Hello guys, Ivan here and this is the Bentley Mulsan 2020 extended wheelbase. So this is a really, really, <laughs> really large limousine guys. In this video I'm going to show you the exterior interior and also the infotainment system and also the rear seats of this great car. So let's check the front of the Bentley Mulsan. Here you can see the flying B. Alright guys, and before we start, give this video a like, comment down below which Bentley model is your favorite and also what kind of color would you choose to spec your Bentley Mulsan. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you are notified for all new videos. So this is the last Bentley Mulsan for sale in Czech Republic and one of the last in Europe, definitely. This car has a lot of chrome in the front and also overall in the car. This is also the Moulinar spec. I will explain what does it mean. And also I will talk about the specifications of this car. So the paint of this car, this is a two-tone paint. And the red paint it's called Dragon Red 2. And the black paint is called Onyx. So the Dragon Red 2 is extrovert color, searing shade that will draw every eye as you drive past, particularly when combined with this black onyx which uses a hint of dark blue which is mixed with darker tones to create the deepest black finish imaginable. And you can really tell it has like blue shades, really really dark blue shades mixed with the black. So very very interesting paint color combination. As you can tell, really, really interesting. And special thanks to Bentley Praha for having me at their showroom to show this unique car. So we have two vertical tail lamps at the back and this car is really, really majestic. It looks really huge and on the road it gives a huge road presence. So the length of this vehicle is almost 6 meters. 5825 millimeters. So this car is really huge. You can see the rear doors, how huge they are. This is just crazy. And the wheelbase is three and a half meters. So the Mulliner specifications with polished wheels includes the 21 inch polished radiance alloy wheels by Mulliner, unique Mulliner thread plate plaques to all four door seals. Coined interior door handles, veneered gear lever, lamps wool racks to front and rear in addition to standards over mats which I will show you in the boot, diamond quilted seats with perforated height crafted using a bespoke new process to ensure every perforation and every stitch is perfect, embroidered Bentley emblems to four seats and intended height headlining. We have also the Hi-Fi system Nime by Bentley. So the veneer for this car is piano black, deep mirror-like black finish applied to fine walnut veneer. Piano black is reminiscent of the impressive grand piano. Lustrous jewel finish, the deep color complements and reflects the elaborate detail of your Bentley hand finished and highly technical piano black is the ultimate statement of modernism. So at the center console you can see all kinds of buttons for the AC and all kinds of gauges and this is the steering wheel. On the left side you can see the controls for the windows and everything in this car is wrapped in a leather But the roll adder is also special, it's called Beluga. And we can see the flying B also on the steering wheel. And these are the two instrument clusters and in the middle you can see the digital display. So this car is not the newest, that's true, but still has some new modern technology. And this car will be replaced by the flying spur. So the manufacturing of this car is at the end and it will be replaced, as I said, by the flying spur. This is the middle unit of the infotainment. And you have all kinds of buttons 
as a shortcuts for the navigation and other sections of the infotainment. Everything is in piano black and the graphics as you can see are pretty solid considering the age of this car and you can see you can set a bunch of stuff in this car and we have dual zone ace unit as you can see here and also the ashtray or little storage you can choose you have also these gauges one is for fuel the middle is time and you have also the coolant temperature at the right side this large gear level with the Mulliner spec this is the glove compartment everything, every mechanism works really really perfect and the embroidered Bentley logos are also part of the Mulliner spec so the leather in this car is called Beluga the leather hides for the Bentley Mulsan are handpicked from the herds of Northern Europe the cooler climate means fewer insects and hence a bite-free height, outstandingly soft to the touch. The height is selected and cut at the same time so that there is as little variation in the texture as possible. For the Mulsan, they have also reverted to a traditional tanning process that enhances the softness and already rich smell of leather. And if you press this button, you can actually open the sun blinds at the rear. So how cool is this? They are like a full curtains. And we have two exclusive seats at the rear. So let's check the rear seats, shall we? So let's open the rear door. The doors are really heavy. And you can immediately see how much space do you have at the rear with this extended wheelbase. And similar to other limousines, the client of this car will probably have a chauffeur and be chauffeured around in this car and not driving it themselves. So we can see also name speaker by Bentley, handcrafted by Bentley Mulliner in England. And these door seals Mulsan. So this looks really, really premium. So this is the Beluga interior. Check out how much space you have at the rear. It's really, really crazy. So I think people of any height can fit here. No problem. And embroidered Bentley logos at the rear seats. So shortly we can jump in. I will show you the features of the rear seats. And the lamps wool racks are actually in the boot. So these are just a standard mats. So let's jump inside and we can check out this interior so the finest materials are used here in the Bentley a lot of chrome details at every button the stitching everything is perfect soft close of the doors and you can see you can control the curtains here with these buttons you can also lock the doors and also windows doors have a premium finish this is just a table for you if you need to work on the something but we have also some other tables which I will show you shortly so everything as you can see here is wrapped and in the leather really really comfortable seats as you can imagine and you have uh, also a lot of storage space And you have also a lot of space in this vehicle, a lot of storage space. And you can see here the glass in the compartment. Underneath you can find some cables. Everything, every mechanism works really, really smoothly. The openings and closing of these doors. Everything is taught to a maximum detail and precision. We have also controls for the AC and here in the middle you have so many compartments here in the middle you can also control these TV displays for the infotainment and also probably to watch movies 
and this whole part in the middle, this is a long console and here we can see the two tables, so these are twin deployable picnic tables and you can use them as a picnic for food or maybe for your laptop to work on these tables they have, uh, it seems they have a, like a complicated mechanism but it's not that complicated once you figure it out how you should open and close them the tables are actually quite heavy so you need to close them uh, really with a caution and yeah everything every hinge feels really really premium you need to press on some hinges on some buttons to actually deploy them or uh, store them back and yeah as you can see here I'm going to show it to you again because uh, I think it's really interesting these tables so I'm sure you can put a laptop there or if you're hungry you can eat something and these are the Beluga interior seats also as you can see the headliner is also in the leather and we have these soft pillows on the top of the headrest to give you a maximum comfort in this vehicle we can also close here this compartment with the tables and you can close the compartment and still have the tables deployed so that's also a really good feature also you have here this middle armrest and on the top you have uh, lights which you can turn on if you don't see what you want to see or maybe you have curtains closed so really really crazy amount of space and features to give you a maximum comfort feeling at the rear and we have also this panoramic window at the top And in the boot space, we can find the lamp spool racks to front and rear. And also you can find the two umbrellas, which are stored here in the boot. So as you can see how fluffy this is, it's really insane. Really ultimate fluffiness for the floor mats, floor racks, we can say. And also for the driver and front passenger. So not only for, for the rear, but also on the for the front, the driver and the passenger so really really great also the ladder for the feet area when they are driving and also it's pretty cool how umbrellas are fixed there actually and this is 2021 Bentley Flying Spur and this is the model which replaces we can say the Mulsan as a top of the line limousine but it is smaller than Mulsan but still it is a very very good car it has better price point and also better dynamics while retaining a great level of luxurious interior and also the quality materials so in this video I'm going to show you exterior interior and infotainment system of this beautiful Bentley and let me know what you think about this car what's your favorite feature of the new Bentley Flying Spur. And if you are interested in more videos, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you are notified for all new videos. So this is the key fob to the new Flying Spur. Really nice and beautiful key fob. So these are the Mulinar driving specification with 22 inch dark gray painted and bright machined alloy wheels. 275, 35, 22 at the front. 315 and 30 22 tires at the rear. So the new flying spur combines breathtaking power and agility to deliver driving experience that is both exhilarating and sophisticated at the same time and it's built around the formidable 6.0 liter W12 engine delivers 635 horsepower and 900 newton meters of torque. The acceleration from 0 to 60 miles per hour happens only in 3.7 seconds and to 100 km per hour in 3.8 seconds the top speed is 207 miles per hour or 333 km per hour and this engine is mated to 8 speed dual clutch transmission which ensures rapid gear shifts and very smooth acceleration the paint of this car is called Hallmark the silver is one of the most popular choices 
among the Bentley owners and now there are 16 different shades of grey and silver and hallmark is the all new tinted silver that has a subtle masculine tone and the first edition has this like flag with number one on the C pillar and this is the rear of the flying spur and you can also see the blue continental so let me know if you want to see a video of that on the left side of this car so here in the taillights we can see that they have a B shape like a Bentley really nice uh, design and you have some other geometric patterns also in these taillights so really really nice design I actually really like this and the whole tail lamp is encased in like a chrome uh, border so we have also chrome around the windows and also on these exhaust pipes we have a chrome and here also on the Bentley on the front fender so this is the Flying B and you can see it's a Bentley emblem it's called Flying B and you can automatically set it so it pops up and down or manually that depends on you here you can see the puddle light also Bentley also here on the door seals we can see illumination of the Bentley it can be in different colors and you can see also the first edition so the upholstery here is called Cricket Ball this is the Bentley name of this dark red upholstery this is very fine soft touch leather with graces virtually every interior surface that isn't metal or wood within the Bentley so everything is covered in leather which is not metal or wood each height is selected by hand from herds raised in northern Europe where cooler weather means fewer insects so we have fewer blemishes on the steering wheel you can see Bentley logo and also chrome circle around it so on the right side you have washer fluid control which is really nice in a chrome color we have here the plus and minus sport shifters and this is the integrator on the left side of the steering wheel underneath you have uh, your cruise control which is adaptive so really really nice uh, new style steering wheel for the dashboard you can see we have all new screen so this is a uh, like a virtual cockpit you can customize it in many ways I will switch to English language very shortly but you can have uh, RPMs uh, speed or you can change it to map you can have a half of the screen as a map or a full screen or uh, only in the middle so this is really nicely uh, customizable and it looks really really great you have many uh, actual traffic controls from the satellite and you have also integration of the Apple CarPlay if you prefer that so in the middle we can see this new infotainment display in the center console and it has beautiful graphics the display itself is not glossy it's like a matte and you can see here actual traffic incidents and if there is traffic jam or even incident here in the system menu you can see the flying bee you can reveal the flying bee or you can conceal it or you can have it in automatic mode so if you unlock the car it will show and if you close the car lock the car it will uh, hide here you can see the massage type massage intensity so actually you have really really uh, a lot of features in this car much more than in the Bentley Mulsan definitely and also the graphics uh, is new so if you are a tech person like myself you will love this car uh, a lot because it's up to date everything was beautiful as you can see these animations also for the AC in the rear so really really fantastic four zone climate control you can also have the Bentley app and you can see the information about the car we have Nime hi-fi system active bass subwoofer bass treble so so many features this car has really a really great infotainment system I can tell you that uh, you can also have here the ambient lights the whole screen can be separated into three sections so you can have here the ambient lights one is like a contrast and others is like a little bit down so you can pair uh, actually two colors so you can choose from seven colors in ambient color and also accent color so you can see here for my feet I can change that separately and also in the middle console there is still the blue color so you can combine it uh, how you want veneer here like a decor is a grand piano you can also set the brightness of the displays and everything is just beautifully made in this car you can see the tire pressures temperature massage seats 
and uh, yeah, everything is built around the comfort and luxury for the occupants as well as the driver. And you can see also the radio tap on the uh, right side. And if you click the button, you can actually see these gauges. So this is outside air temperature, this is compass. And here you can see like lap timer, I think that's, the, that's it. So uh, this is like an old school classic design, you can have also display. And if you don't like either of these, you can actually close it and have a, just a black mm, veneer, this line. So if you're like a classic person, you don't want to have anything, you don't like this place, so you can choose uh, what you like. So that's, I think it's a really good feature, because not everyone is like a tech fanatic, so if you don't want that, can hide it and yeah, that's it. Here you can see the clock in the middle, analog clock. You have also uh, the vents for the AC and here you can see dials for the seats, ventilation, heated seats. And uh, this is for the temperature of the AC. Start stop engine button is here in the middle. You have sport, Bentley, comfort and custom mode. And you can turn off the traction control, but probably you wouldn't do that in this car. And here in the middle you have two cup holders, and uh, yeah, that's that, below that. We've also the shifter for the automatic gearbox, of course, in this car, uh, only automatic. Both of these seats have like this, like a cocoon uh, in a leather, so really interesting design, a really good design, like a modern classic, I would say. Still looks classical, but still it looks modern and high-tech. The seats are really beautifully made. You can see diamond stitching here on the bottom and you have different stitching on the back seat. Really good level of the comfort for, for the front seats. So here at the top you can control the curtains and also the panoramic roof, uh, open and close it. And here you have the cosmetic mirror with sun visor. Everything is in leather, as you can see, also the ceiling, also this handle, so just about everything. Ceiling is also in smooth leather here. Here you can see this closes uh, really quickly, actually I will show you also how it closes from the rear seats. And the panoramic groove is made from uh, two sections. So here in the rear you can see the seats, soft close mechanism from the front and rear doors, that's basically standard in this uh, type of vehicle for many years. But I want to show you that as well. So if you have a blue accent color, you have also blue uh, on the Bentley and uh, at the door seals, as you can see, so it changes with the colors. That's really interesting. So we have a lot of room here in the rear part of the Bentley. So the name speakers have actually not a chrome at the rear, but they have the same color cricket ball as is the upholstery. Here the door cards have a specific design, as you can see, like a 3D shape. And that's very interesting. And controls for the seats are here on the door memory seats. And you can of course have it heated or ventilated. You can see the hi-fi system also on the B-pillar and soft close from the rear. Seat belts have also the same color as is the leather here, cricket ball. And you have cosmetic mirrors also for the rear seats. So everything, every hinge has a quality to it. If you press it, you can feel definitely that this is a made of a top level materials. You have also these cards and the rear of the front seats and you have a lights which you can control at the back section. You can also close the curtains which I will show you and do have this smaller infotainment display at the rear. You can also reveal and conceal the flying bee from the rear so that's pretty <laughs> pretty cool that you can do that also from the rear. And you can adjust just about anything from the rear what you can from the front you can close the sun blinds actually it happens so fast that i barely could film that and uh, it opens also here as you can see super fast one of the fastest 
blinds which I filmed in any car so the engines for the blinds are quite uh, fast actually so overall fantastic uh, comfort level for the seats uh, if I remember correctly the Mulsan seats uh, were a little bit softer uh, to sit in so this is a little bit less soft but still still very soft so the Bentley craftsmanship is just about everywhere in this car so you can have a chauffeur which will chauffeur you around or you can have it as a driver and you can just about drive anywhere you need you can do that also in Bentley Continental so if you need to carry more passengers than you and someone else like four passengers then probably this is a better choice for you or maybe the Bentley Bentayga if you like a SUV so that's up to you but um, yeah, some people prefer the limousine more than SUV so uh, Bentley has a offer for everyone so also let me know if you want to see the new Bentayga the SUV which is uh, all new generation now so that would be interesting also to see here on the rear infotainment you can change also the ambient lights and you can also change the level of brightness of uh, ambient accent and ambient lights and you can have a also softer light which will have a less brightness so you can change and choose from seven colors so you have a red a yellow orange green these kind of colors you have also yellow you can also turn it off if you don't like that so that's up to you uh, what would you like you can see here the on the door card we have a green stripe or blue stripe you can change it up and here at the storage space down in the doors you can have different color so you can match it up depending on your liking actually and you can see there you have like a pink uh, green and also the purple shade so that's really good for uh, occupants of the rear to change it up here in the middle you have uh, some storage space 12 volt socket and and also here you have USB A charging ports two charging ports here in the middle section and we have some other storage space at the front for two cup holders and uh, yeah this whole section is also in leather and you can also put it back if you need to carry five passengers so there's also an option in this car of course the middle seat is smaller but you can carry in emergency if you need that you have also the ski hatch if you want to go with this car to mountains to uh, go for a ski holiday and here you can see you can press the button and see the storage space for the flying spur so the boot capacity is 420 liters and you can see the subwoofer at the rear and also the ski hatch you can see also these hinges here so you can connect something here like a net everything is from the metal so really really fantastic underneath the boot floor you can find tire kit and some other things despite the 420 liters i think it looks larger than the number or right, I guess so that's it for this video. Let me know what's your favorite Bentley model. Here the Flying Spur or the two-door Bentley Continental GT or maybe the SUV Bentley Bentayga. Leave your top pick in the comment section down below. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell so you are notified for all new videos. And guys, thank you very much for watching. I will see you soon in the next video. Have a wonderful day.